Hi everyone, Cheeky Tam here. Today I'm going to be opening this and it's a package of stuff that Lily has sent me from the UK. She's packaged this up extremely well. Bubble wrap on it as well. And more paper, like past the parcel. <gasps> oh, hello. I love this. We don't have squirrels in Australia. We've got wombats, koalas, kangaroos, platter, weird animals. We've got weird animals here in Australia. That's going to sit up there. A card. I love this card and she's also put lovely little stamps in here as well and she's written a little bit about the products and things that she has sent. Oh another letter. Oh wow this is a homemade one. Lizzie has also sent this amazing little homemade card which I love and inside it she's got some artwork which has a real rainbow theme going on. Oh I like that one. So in the comments below please let Lizzie know how amazing her artwork is. She's wrapped up everything individually. So it kind of feels like it's my birthday. Oh, Werther's Original. I have had these and I absolutely love them. But for those of you who don't know, let's have a look. How gorgeous. I mean, just the packaging alone makes it look kind of magical. Let me show you this. Oh, oh. oh. That's a little bit of golden deliciousness right there. Mmm. So they kind of want it, sorry, I'm going in my mouth still. I'm pretending it's not there, but it is. So they're, they're kind of sweet that you suck on for a while, but then you get a little bit impatient and then you chomp on into it. I've done it. It's happened. Werther's are a smooth, buttery, delicious toffee. They've got such a buttery finish to them. And what's good about these is that they last you a long time. Yes, ooh, and they are one of my favorite. I only dropped one. Let me know in the comments below if you get these in your country and you love them, you've got to love them. Another present. Ooh, I have not tried these before. Fox's Glacier Fruits, I don't really know why I held my hand out like this. I guess to just be a little bit creepy. Back in 1897, the Fox family started producing sweets. Eric Fox first established Fox's Glacier Mints in 1918. It doesn't matter, I'm not having the mints, I'm having the fruits. New varieties are still being produced under the watchful eye of Peppy. Someone's name's Peppy? The UK's favorite bear. What? What, what, do you, what? what do you mean? Why is a bear making these? Oh, there's a bear on the front front of it, but still, why is he making them? Under the watchful eye of Peppy. Wouldn't that be an interesting boss? I was actually thinking one of Eric's relatives, like his son, son's brother, sister's brother, was named Peppy, and they've now taken over the company. But it's not, it's a bear, everyone. Oh. Okay, so they're all the same colored packaging on the outside. Guys, your fruits, are they all the same fruit? Oh, oh, that's beautiful. Wow, I love them, I do. They have a really nice flavor to them. I keep hiding things in my cheeks so I can talk to you. I'm multi-skilling. Are they all the same flavor? I'm just gonna open up another one so I can see if it's the same. Yes, yeah, okay, so they're all exactly the same. It's got a lovely fruit flavor through it, but I don't really know what kind of fruit it is. I think it's a combination of fruits. One of those things, again, where you're supposed to suck on it for a while instead of crunch down. I can't resist and I always crunch into them. I sort of get to a point and think, yeah, yeah, I've made it. I'm gonna make it all the way and they go, Arr. I can't believe I've never had these before. We don't get these in Australia and I absolutely love these. <gasps> After eight. I have actually had some after eights, but like in a little tiny bar form, but I haven't had them in a fancy box like this. I love the presentation of them in the box. That really just makes them something special. These are made by Nessa and straight away you can smell them in as soon as you open the box. I'll just show you inside here. You ready? Are you ready? My old woman voice, because we all love that. Look at this. So they come in little tiny envelopes like that. Oh, I think I'm in love. Now that is something that you could serve at a fancy dinner party afterwards, you know, like with coffees and teas. If you brought those out, everyone's just gonna think you're super classy. Ooh, oh. Oh. I love them. 
That chocolate is really beautiful and smooth. It's kind of like a dark chocolate. And on the inside, it's got a thin layer of that white gooey mint filling. How good is that? And you can see how thin that is. They're quite rich though, so you couldn't really eat that. Actually, I could probably eat a lot of them. <laughs> I'm saying, oh, you wouldn't eat a lot of them. I, I, but I would. Thank you so much, Lizzie, for sending all of these amazing treats. You selected some fantastic things. And this, I love this. And if everyone in the comments below could thank Lizzie for sending all of this stuff, because without her, these taste tests wouldn't be possible. Please remember to give this video the thumbs up and subscribe for more. I'll see you next time. Have a fantastic week, everyone. Bye. Hi, everyone. It's just me again. I just want to let you know. Can you understand what I'm saying? I just want to let you know that I know I'm talking with something in my mouth again. I've had another one of these box glacier fruits after after I finished filming and they are different flavors. There's about five different flavors in them. What are the chances of me actually getting just the same flavor? Well, pretty good, obviously. Yeah, so the one I'm having is like a red flavor. I really didn't want to see that, but hey, there it is.